In the UK, we have a TV show called MasterChef, which basically consists of people trying to outcook each other using ingredients which almost certainly don't exist in real life, such as Cavalo Nero, Kohlrabi, and Hen of the Woods mushrooms. The contestants also use things which do exist in real life but should not be eaten, at least not by humans. For example, bone marrow, charcoal, and hay. As well as using mysterious ingredients, they also undertake strange cooking practices such as smoking everything, using liquid nitrogen instead of the freezer, and frying things which should not be fried, such as lettuce. Personally, I've never understood this behaviour, but when I found myself with a little gem and a spare Friday night, I decided to give it a go. Now the sensible thing would have been to shove fried lettuce into Google and find out how to do it properly. I neglected to do this, reasoning that frying a lettuce was just too self-explanatory to warrant searching for instructions. How wrong I was. Things started off reasonably well, by which I mean the lettuce looked decent when I first put it in the pan. I decided to attempt a honey glaze, which consisted of olive oil, honey and some seasoning. Again, no googling involved. In hindsight, this glaze was probably my undoing. Problems appeared when the lettuce started to cook. While I was hoping for a nice char and a crispy, refreshing bite, what I actually ended up with was an overwhelmingly greasy little gem which could at best be described as limp. I persevered with my optimistic lettuce frying for a while, but was forced to admit that the situation wasn't rectifiable. My husband looked at it and said in his best MasterChef judge voice, I don't want to eat that. To be fair, I could see where he was coming from. So therein ended my lettuce frying experiment. I concluded that, as I had long suspected, lettuce belongs in a salad and MasterChef cooking techniques do not translate into real life. Next time on Neurotic Thinkings, travel tales, visiting my grandmother's hometown. Why not click subscribe for more rantings, queries and general cynicism. Thanks for watching.